Another forces is here. This structure. This structure is for removing some particles from the emitter. If you bring it as you can see in the default, it's a simple cube. And it has simple two options. Just for size, x, y, and z axis. And the randomness. Actually, this is a string of that. If you play particle as you, as you can see, if it hits this destructor shape, it will be destruct, disappear. And it depends exactly at the size. If you have more, if you have less, and depend on and this randomness, if you increase it, as you can see, some particle are passing through that. And some other will be destruct you can see it going to the emitter and lifetime emission to the end nice i want it to the end and that's it but as you can see for example i have one, uh, this number and all uh, a lot of particle path through but if you increase the size let's see we have less some of them are Mm, destructing exactly at the middle it's in the real world thinner or thicker wall can affect the uh, particle that passing through right so the particle passing through this uh this destructor is depending on the randomness actually strengths and as z or any direction that the <clears throat> Uh, emitter that are following path through that okay so play with them to see that that's it hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release